Irishman Pub and Restaurant is debuting in downtown Lafayette this weekend. It's opening in the old Pure Eatery building on 4th and Main. This will be the 12th restaurant Robert Turner has opened or helped open in just 14 years. He says this newest venture is the real deal for him. All right, cool. Here we go. Uh, so this is the dining room here. Robert Turner is ready to take the restaurant business to the next level. With three floors for seating, space for private parties, and a rooftop patio, there's plenty of room to dream. Somebody on a banjo and harmonica and acoustic guitar, so we'll do live music here. And it doesn't stop there. This is one of a kind. There's another outdoor patio downstairs. It's awesome. But Turner's favorite part is what's going on in the back. Like once we get it totally built out, maybe call it like Old Smoky, have a little name on there so everybody can see it. And if they don't see the smokehouse, they'll definitely smell it. All the neighbors around, man, everybody's talking about how it's like perfume, especially a windy day like today. Turner isn't sure about his heritage, but he says he's always been Irish at heart. Throughout my life, I've drank enough Guinness and I've definitely drank enough Jameson that uh, there is Irish running through this blood. And he loves a full plate of Irish food. I'm going to talk about the barbecue meatloaf. That is my favorite dish. I can confirm it's delicious. It doesn't even taste like meatloaf. It's like another kind of invention. That's it's so I, good. I appreciate it. That's why that's that's why it's going to be your signature dish. But at the end of the day, Turner says it's not just the food or location that makes the restaurant. Good staff, good people. All right, now the smoking Irishman is going to be a weekend brunch spot as well, huh? Yes, starting in May, you can eat brunch there on Saturday and Sunday at 9 in the morning. I mean, y you have to see it to believe it. It's so beautiful, that building is. And the food is so delicious. I've got some <laughs> barbecue sauce still on my shirt, and I've been smelling it all day, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I want to go back. It looked good as well. <laughs> it all was right. delicious. Let's get a look ahead at the Easter weekend forecast. Meteorologist Chad Evans. Hey, Chad. And now, your Precision 18 forecast. News 18. Weather from where you live. Well, cool now. Some frost over the